What's up everyone? It's Cannibal Crab. It's Comment Survival. Let's just jump right into the episode by introducing to a little friend that I had up here during the beginning uh, when I was about to record. Oh, I don't know what the heck this is, but uh, let's go say hi. Uh, clearly it looks like a villager, so I don't know if he... if he... Did you attach the llama to... Oh no, it's in his hand. Okay, I thought he attached it to my house. Hello, who are you? What the... So this is the new trading system, huh? The Wandering Trader. We got beetroot seeds, orange dye, nothing I really need. Six emerald for a blue, what the heck is blue ice? We're just not even gonna worry about that right now. That looks like the most, that's the cutest llama I've ever seen though. <laughs> All right, well, I don't really need anything guys. So uh, anyways, guys, I'm gonna look at the comments. So apparently you guys want me to make a blast furnace. So I'm gonna figure out how to make a blast furnace. And I think we just need more iron. We have three iron right now. Uh, let's go ahead and put that in there. Do we have any more in here? No, it doesn't look like it. So oh, we're going to get into the mine. We're going to get some iron because that is pretty much required for everything else that we kind of want to make. So is there a blast furniture here? No, just the smithing turn. Uh, so furnace and a uh, smoker. Now let's go get some iron. Also, you guys wanted me to make some sort of strip mine. Apparently, we, I got to go down to 13 or 14, I think it said. Uh, and then start strip mining then because that's the best uh, it's the most efficient way of a strip mine So we're gonna go down to Y 13 or 14 uh, I'm gonna dig down a little bit. Hopefully oh, we gotta make some more torches. Oh, we got five That sh might be enough. We'll have to see but I'm gonna go down to 13 and I'll be right back in one sec Looks like we have stumbled upon a cave now I, It sounds like there's a billion zombies around me, so I'm really scared. Uh, so let's drop down here Let's make a little staircase actually. Eh, there we go. Just so we can get back up if we need to uh Oh Oh, there's an Enderman. Oh, there's so many mobs over there. We do not want to go over there, but we're going to put a torch. Oh, God. Okay. Uh, oh, you're going to get the skeleton first. Oh. Zombie. Zombie. Down. Dead. And skeleton. Come back. Blow up, creeper. Blow up. Ah. Yes, I blocked. I blocked. All right. That buys us time to heal. Oh, there's a zombie right there, too. Oh my god, guys, this is intense Minecraft combat right now. Oh, I missed. You really cannot miss. Oh god, that's a lot of zombies. Hello. Oh, snap. Hopefully there's nothing behind me. It definitely sounds like there is. Another skeleton. We are farming. We are farming. Ah. Okay, this is intense. All right. That was this is probably the most intense survival Minecraft moment of my life right now. Because <laughs> I haven't really played that much. Uh, let's go down this way. There's less mobs over here. Uh-oh. I have hear the zombie. So we did we did find pretty decent sized cave actually. There's a okay, there's a zombie over there. More skeletons. Uh, I'm just looking for iron, man. I need some iron. Oh snap. Ugh. Block. Ugh. Oh, dang it. Ugh. Boom! There we go. Ugh. We got some coal. Oh my god. Oh my god, look at this cave. This place is huge. Oh, I should Oh god. This is I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh! Whew. This is intense. Why are there so many mobs here? I gotta heal. Oh, right in the face. All right, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Nice, hit the zombie. What's up? Yeah. There we go. <laughs> All right, anyways, let's, oh, there's some iron. Nice, we got some iron at least. There looks like there's some more over here. All right, so we should have enough. What is that? Gravel. Ah, it's a pitfall. What the heck was that? All right, oh, we got some iron. Let's grab all this iron. Let's get back to base. Let's use the iron pickaxe just to speedy Gonzales this a little bit. And then we're going to head back to base with a plethora of iron. Oh, yeah. All right, so my favorite part of the new 1.14 so far, or, well, not really the 1.14, but newer Minecraft is the shield. This thing is coming in handy so much already with skeletons. Ah, all right, we are back at base. Now, I think we have to make some, uh, we got some iron right there. We need to make some smooth stone to get the blast furnace recipe. So we're going to go and do that up. Let's go ahead and throw our... Uh, all our cobble or iron in the, the top furnaces and let's get this cooked up baby All right now with the stone done. We should have some new recipes. Oh look at all them. Yeah We got some new recipes. So let's go ahead and grab all our iron. Oh, we got a lot of iron Yeah, so let's go ahead and two into our curtains here We got a smithing table so far, which I just read in the comments when you put this next to a villager and it turns it into a smithing villager Okay, that's a uh, knowledge gained I'm assuming you put his next to a villager as well. He like starts cutting stone, maybe. All right, I was reading the comments. So apparently, we need to take this stone and then put it into the furnace once again, and then hopefully this will make uh, the stone required. Jesus, that's a lot of steps. <laughs> Let's grab the rest of the iron here. Uh, also, a tripwire hook. We need a stick. I think an iron ingot and a cobblestone. I believe it was maybe a plank. <gasps> we have a smooth stone. There it is. 
We got the blast furnace recipe. All right, let's look up how to make it. So we need three smooth stone, a furnace. Okay, we can make a furnace. We have plenty of iron, and we have now the smooth stone, baby. Let's make the furnace. Let's put that right here, uh, the iron. Let's go ahead and grab the smooth stone. All right, it's three smooth stone, a furnace, and then iron around it. Blast furnace, baby! So we got the smoker for food, the blast furnace for ores, and then the uh, obviously the vanilla furnaces for whatever. All right, so smooth stone. That's pretty cool. I'm glad that you can make smooth stone recipe now. So maybe it's just that? Nope. Uh... How about, uh, like that? Oh, we got it! That was, <laughs> I just threw him in there and then I made it so sweet. Now we can make the cross bow. Oh, all right, so we got a two string. We got two string. Easy, easy clap, barrel, string, boom. And then the string on the left and right of this. Yes, we got it! Let's go! All right, dude, how many irons or errors do we have? Let's see, uh, we don't have a lot. Uh, crap, uh, anyways, let's test it out. Oh yeah, I'm ready. Let's go! So apparently, if you don't sleep for a while, a reaper comes to kill you or something. That sounds terrifying, so I think I need to find another sheep real quick, and then I'm gonna slay it with my crossbow. Actually, we should make some shears um, before we... Yeah, we can just do shears, and we'll shear the wool off the sheep, and that should be pretty easy. Aha! Ah, I finally found some sheep. Although, uh, we need three of the same... No, I think it can be different colors. Alright, oh my god, we are starving too. Lots of running. All right, next pro tip, by the way, after this sheep, let me go ahead and share your wool, and one wool, and give me two. Huh! Oh. Ah, think th when they eat the grass, they grow their uh, their wool back, so we might have to adventure maybe a little bit. But anyways, if you take the axe, pro tip from the comments, straight from the comments, we right click to strip the wood, and then we mine it up, and it's actually stripped oak wood, I believe is the uh, the name of it. Stripped oak logs. So that's pretty cool. All right, so let's find another sheep, or and we can come back and see if they grew their uh, their wool back. But anyways, we need to get. Oh, there's a cow. We need leather. Now that I think about it, I completely forgot to actually test the crossbow out. So I think for the crossbow test, we are gonna purge these trespassers from our home. Yay! Woo! I got a cheapy for it at least. Oh, they're running. Get back here. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna kill him. It's fine. Oh, he's spreading at me. Oh! Calm down! Okay, I didn't know they were a, a group. Dang! Oh! He's dead. I gotta kill your llamas now. They're aggressive. I'm sorry! Oh, I punched it to death. Boom! We have our first battle, ladies and gentlemen. So let's put that right there. So we're gonna get some sand here, and we are going to get whatever recipes sand will unlock. 25 sand later, and I'm about to go back to the base. All right, so let's go ahead and cook this up, and I wonder what you cook this up into. Maybe the blast furnace? Let's see. Uh, let's get some coal from here. Oh, we are running low on coal. Uh, do we have any of the chests? Yeah, we do. Okay, so let's go ahead and throw this in here, the blast furnace, and let's see if we can blast furnace some sand. Whoosh. No. All right, so let's go ahead and switch that to... I don't think you can smoke glass, so it seems like this default thing is only... Uh, what you cook glass in. So we're gonna have to wait a little bit for the gra uh, the glass to cook. Now, what can you do with glass? Oh, we can make a glass bottle. What is this? A painting? Okay, this the painting looks pretty cool now. A lot different. Uh, we can make some paper. We did pick up some sugar cane from uh, the little journey we just took. So we got some. Uh, oh, we got some sugar, obviously. Um, had nothing really too much, but let's go ahead and make some paper. Yeet! And some sugar just to get the recipes for it. And then we need to start making some chests. So let me go ahead and turn this into wood and then I'm gonna make a bunch of chests so we can just get a little bit organized before I move on to the next command. All right, I just woke up from sleeping in my bed and look what was happening overnight. I wish that when you slept in bed, it would like, it, it would increase the time by like a couple days or something. <laughs> or not a couple days, I would say, but a couple, uh, you know, ticks. Uh, but anyways, we have the smooth stone now and I've been making like a crap ton of the smooth stone because I wanna make a crap ton of blast furnaces. We're gonna make a giant blast furnace room. So we gonna need some iron. Uh, I put a chest in here. This has all like the precious materials that I think are kind of important uh, for what we need. And then over here is just gonna be like the junky stuff uh, for now. But we need a ton of cobblestone for this. And, or no, we don't need cobblestone. Yeah, we need cobblestone, okay. So we need to make the furnaces. So let's go make them as many furnaces as we can. We made eight. And then smooth stone on the bottom. And then iron all around. And we have, let's make four just to start off with. And that should help our ore processing a lot. Uh, we'll put another one right there. So we got blast furnaces on deck. I need to go farm some coal and uh, farm a bunch of ore and hopefully we can find some gold and uh, redstone maybe even. Um, but making this mine. So we got to make the mine down to Y14 or 13 or whatever and then uh, yeah that's going to take a little second so I'll be right back. What the heck did I just... What the heck was that? 
Hold on, let's get a torch in here. I think I just spawned like a monster or something. Hold on, let's go around. Oh, the, ah, ah, that is still spawned. What is that? Silverfish, kill it. Ah, what's going on? I need to kill it quick. Oh my God, this is hard. This is difficult. Ah. I've never even faced these legitimately in survival Minecraft before. That was really strange. Uh, uh, we got some cobblestone, so let's go build a little staircase out. Man, that scared the crap out of me. I didn't know silverfish. I didn't know that blocks instantly broke. I thought like he stole to mine it. Okay, what was that? That scared me a little bit, but it was just diorite or whatever. <laughs> oh, Jesus. And we will begin our strip mining operations that apparently you guys think is the most efficient way to strip mine. All right, so I got my little space uh, cleared out, and it sounds like there's some zombies back here. I think there's like a cave maybe right above me or below me. Uh, dangerous cave this low, probably. So we're going to go ahead and do your strip mine technique so you guys said to do uh two right here and then you basically just dig infinitely and then we skip we skip uh one like that because we can see both sides anyway and then we go that so that's the strip mine technique that i've probably used before too um but it may be the most efficient so will we find diamonds i don't know but i'm going to mine a little bit and then we're going to come back and uh, we're going to see redstone baby whoever said to dig at y13 you're the hero redstone already and uh now we just need diamond where's the diamond oh there we go baby i found some gold our first gold of the series so let's see what we got we got one two three gold oh it keeps on going five six oh my god it goes into an iron ore let's go it sounds like there's some kind of craziness right in front of me like some spiders or something maybe a dungeon but let's go ahead and see let's dig up a little bit it sounds like we're getting closer and closer anything in here oh there's a space that means it is a cave ah what the heck stupid die thing all right we got some arrows oh we can use a crossbow now let's go ahead and lower the bolt in i'm sure we can make that fa oh Yay! let's go up cobblestone and four oh zombies down kill it kill it kill it oh god this ah! skeleton too there we go. We got some arrows now. Oh, what the heck is this? This doesn't look like a cave. It looks like a little dungeon area. Eh. Ugh. There we go. He's down. Oh, I got a heal. Hold up. Hold up. Let me block that. Block the next one. There we go. Oh, I blocked it into him. That was sick. All right. So let's get uh, let's get full food here and let's see what's in this little cave. Maybe there'll be diamond in here. We are pretty low. Oh, baby. What's going to be down here? Redstone and zombies. Ah! Easy, easy, easy. All right. Well, the combat is just too simple, guys. Once I get diamond enchanted armor, it's over for these mobs. It is over. Uh oh. I gotta get across this pool. There's gotta be diamonds down here in this pool of lava. Uh, let's find out. Wait. What the heck? I'm at 11 height, and there's literally the world right there. Hold on. Hold on, I've never seen anything like this before in Minecraft. We are at 11 height, and I literally... Oh, okay. <laughs> it was a glitch, a fa false alarm, guys. I was, I was really confused there for a second. <laughs> Alrighty, we are back in my little strip mine. So, it was a semi-successful trip, I suppose. We got six gold ore, we got two stacks of redstone dust, and, and 31 extra. Look how... Oh, look how cool I look with this crossbow. I'm so excited that they add crossbows in the game. Hopefully they got some crazy enchants for them. Uh, but yeah, let me know in the comments if I should figure out how to enchant this crossbow and let me know what enchants and it can actually work for it because that's pretty interesting um so now that we have redstone and gold or gold we can introduce um, whatever recipes those add so let's go ahead and look it up a book redstone dust nothing really yet we're gonna have to make it back to the crafting table uh but let me know in the comments what i should do with the gold what i should do with the redstone should i make some automated stuff let me know and i will certainly build it because that's what this series is all about but anyways we have the blast furnace done we have the strip mine semi done it's it's kind of small right now but we're getting there okay we're getting there uh and uh we had the uh the loom we made a banner for the loom but it still didn't really work i'm gonna have to figure that out um you probably have to put dye in it or something but 
Anyways, let me know in the comments what I should do next. Uh, I think the, me the most logical step next would be probably to find a village and then move all my stuff over there. Uh, and then maybe make a strip mine there. And then we can start building up our little village. Because I think 1.14 is all about that. So that will be pretty fun. Let me know if I should do that in the comments. And then what else, once I get there, what I should do to them. Should I murder everyone and just make it my own village? Or should I have a bunch of iron, gar uh, iron golems, I think they're called? Yeah, guarding the place. So let me know in the comments. This has been Cannibal Crab. This has been Comments or Survival uh, 1.14. It doesn't really have an official name or anything. It's just fun. But anyways, I'll see you guys in the next episode. This is Kettle Crab signing out.